afternoon. Matt, what's this all about? Well, Mark, you know, New Haven's mayor says it's so important for kids to be able to stay in school and this new policy that the district has, well, that will allow kids to ensure that they continue to learn. So, as we said, starting next week, New Haven will begin this test and stay policy for unvaccinated students. Previously, the policy was that if there was a potential COVID exposure, those students would have to quarantine up to 10 days. Now, starting next Tuesday, unvaccinated students who are exposed to COVID but don't have any symptoms can keep coming to school as long as they test negative for five straight days, a requirement that's actually more stringent than the CDC's recommendation. The city says its policy is possible thanks to more than 20,000 rapid at-home test kits the school district recently received. We have a lot of wet rapid tests in the schools right now, and so that gives us the capacity to do this. And our policy is much more stringent than what the CDC is recommending and what the state is recommending, because we wanna make absolutely sure we're keeping our kids and our community safe. So what do parents think? Well, we're gonna have that part of the story come up tonight on Eyewitness News at six. We're live with the mobile newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. Matt, thank you very much.